Yo, what's up guys? Today I'm going to be starting a new series on my channel. It's called Tips and Tricks. All it is is just to uh, enhance your gameplay, make you play way better than you already do. Just give you some tactics just to like outsmart people, be better than people and yeah, that's pretty much it. Hopefully you enjoyed this series and you want me to carry it on. I know I don't have that many subs but I'm just going to try it anyways and see what happens with it. People like it, people don't. But from my gameplay and the way I play, I'm going to give you some tips and tricks from that. And yeah, that's it pretty much. And I'm also going to be telling you how to level up faster and how to get these battle stars quicker. And that's it guys. Um, yeah. The first tip I'm going to be showing you today is that there is three tiers in the game. So every week they've been releasing these... Uh, these loading screens and in the loading screens there's been easter eggs that are separate from everything else for the challenges so these are things you can actually just do anyways um, so the first one there's actually a faded out battle star on top of the tower and that's a whole free tier for you so if you go get that that's a whole free tier done and this week's challenges the one that just came out there's four different um, grid references on the in the picture and in those grid references, if you go in between all of them and find the center of all of them, the direct center, then you're going to find the, a free battle tier. And that's it, guys. That's pretty much it. If you go to all those locations, like I just said, then you're going to find everything. So just visit all the top of the towers and visit directly in the middle of all the grid references. And then you should find two free tiers and that's done. So you can level up your battle pass quickly. So I'm just going to let the gameplay roll and just let you see where the exact locations of each of these two things are. And next week I'm going to drop the next one as well. So look around for that. So this next uh, thing I'm going to show you is how to do this thing I like to call pop shotting. So this is uh, basically, as you see in the gameplay behind me, I'm aiming at the guy. Well, not at the guy, but I'm trying to aim around the uh, vicinity of the guy. And as I'm doing that, I'm just lining up a shot in a sense. I'm lining the shot up for when I stand up, because when I stand up is when I'm going to shoot. I'm not going to stand up. Like, I'm not gonna try shoot when I'm crouching because I'm just gonna hit my base. As you see, I miss a couple shots here and there, but that's just me adjusting and trying to get the right, like, uh, how do I say it, bullet drop uh, length. So, like, just getting the right distance between me and the guy. And then when I finally line up the shot and get it correctly, all I do is stand up, bang, go back down. So it's hard to hit me, but it's easy to hit him because the bullet's going straight towards him. But his bullets are coming towards me and my head's never going to be popping out that much for that long. So as you see, I like I just got a kill and that's how you do it. You just pop up, bang, pop down. That's it, pretty much. You know, I'm going to show you a couple of them and then you guys can try this in your own gameplay and see how it works. I'm just letting you know, most of the time this stuff does actually work if they're trying to snipe you. That's one thing you've got to keep in your mind. If they're trying to snipe you, this always works. So the final tip I'm going to be giving you guys is play smart, you know, like most people just play dumb, they play for just kills and then they end up having the worst like win record, they have like like 30 wins or so and then they're just complaining about like, oh I can't get any wins, I can't get this, I can't get that, 
just just switch all the I want to get kills all this and that off learn how to win first and once you learn how to win and you get those wins after that then you can start trying to get kills with those wins because if you ain't getting wins you ain't gonna get kills same uh, vice versa if you ain't getting kills you ain't gonna get wins there's a way you can play smart as in like oh you could just sit back all game and just relax but that's that's not really what you're gonna be doing if you're gonna be having fun on the game um, but yeah except from that we'll just play smart just understand what you're doing know the things you're doing like learn from the game every time you die you learn so take it all in so if you die you get RPG'd in the back think of why you got RPG'd in the back think of why that gap was open for them to shoot you think of all the small things and then add them up together and make yourself a better round, all around player that's what I've been doing over like months on this game right now and that's why I've like I can make montages and stuff about how good I am I'm not trying to brag I'm just saying that's how it is land the places like uh, the the factories at the bottom and left of the map land there land at like houses in the middle of nowhere start off there then go to bigger places like tilted once you can handle the gunfights and you learn from your mistakes so that's how you get better at the game as a player as a whole but well, that's it from that guys thanks for watching the video hopefully you picked something up for this video today i'm just trying to give my gameplay to you lot in the sense of speaking but that's it from that guys yeah leave a like subscribe and peace